a brand new standalone MCS slide check on off valve. Let's have a closer look and see how it works. Dum, da, dum, dum. Hey guys, Sean here. Well, this has been a long time coming. Tiberius, long time ago, had something very similar, much sought after, rare, on off valve. It's now been recreated by Modern Combat Sports. This is called a slide check. It functions like this. There are two sets of holes here. You can see them, a lower one and a, and a higher one. They go all the way around. There are two O-rings inside this collar, one here and one on the top. In the closed position, in the off position, you can see the upper set of holes kind of right around the edge here. That's because the air is being trapped by these two O-rings against your bottle. When you move it into the open position, it allows that air to jump from this set of holes to this set of holes and then out to your launcher. Now the beauty of these is when you move it back to the closed position, the marker, the air that is trapped inside your marker vents out that top set of holes, degassing your launcher completely, making it safe. This is beauty for readiness and for safety. Um, should you encounter a jam or what have you, just a quick flick of this, your bolt will retract and then you can drop your jam out. Or if you need this in a hurry, on. No twisting, no dials, no funky business. Super quick, super efficient. I'm sure glad this exists now because now I don't have to throw it all <laughs> my non-slide check regulators like this one. And how this one differs from this one, you can see this regulator has a, the slide check regular has a retaining ring, this little snap ring right here, which prevents you from pulling the collar off. In this case, you saw me, I can pull it right off, which makes servicing this very easy. And, you know, should it get stuck on your bottle, this does have two flats here. So you can actually move this up and get a wrench on it right here and unthread it or take it right off, get a wrench on there. You know the deal. Now, I saw a video this morning actually of uh, MCS with a 88 gram, 90 gram CO2 adapter in the rear of this. <sighs> I would not recommend using CO2 in a slide check. I have, I've done it. CO2, as you know, can swell your O-rings and there is a pin in this so when you screw your bottle in, this slide check becomes live until you move it to the on position and then it blows your air into the launcher. Now, if you had CO2 jammed up against that, it's on your O-rings. All the time, it will leak. It's just a matter of time. But to each their own, I just wouldn't recommend it. So let's try this thing out. Thread it in your marker. It's gonna, okay, so first of all, I wouldn't thread it on your bottle first. You can see there's not much to grip onto here. Uh, I mean, I guess you could put the wrench on there and, and tighten it against your bottle, but easiest thing here is thread it into your launcher. Goes in nice and easy like that. And you know what, before we do anything else, let's compare this to some other on off. So this is the this is the Home Defense 24, like twisty type. I mean, look how short this MCS thing is. It's really short. Uh, we got a GOG here. MCS is shorter. You know we could all use shorter in our launchers. If we want to make them longer, we'll make them longer, but let's start short. <laughs> um, and also when you pair it with, you know, one of these first strike Short regulators compared to, here's like a standard, you know, run of the mill regulator. 
Uh, you can shave even more length off. So thread it in, thread your bottle in, and you'll hear it hiss. Well, you didn't hear it, but I heard it. Another bonus of this type of on off is once the bottle's in there tight, see, I can orient that tank wherever I want. If you don't have an adjustable or a clockable regulator, you can literally tighten this into however you want. And in this case, you know, the M17 has a guide bar here. So you don't want it like that because then the nipple gets in the way. So you can literally just tighten it and it'll stay because it is pressurized up to this point. In the off position, on position, off position. And now your marker is completely safe. Let's put a couple of rounds through it. There you go. This is a 10 CI bottle on here. You can see, obviously I don't have butt stock on it, but it makes it much more usable as opposed to, you know, your standard M17 like this. And this goes for any launcher. I make it as short as you want now, really. These things are beauty. 9.9 uh, .9 gram ride ball. Not that it's that important. On. Off. On. Off. That's simple, guys. Thread it in and go. <laughs> so I'll uh, I'll put the link to it down in the uh, the description. Modern Combat Sports saves a lot of headaches. <laughs>